It's a second Ulster win in the ORDS. How much does that mean to you and the team? That was amazing. Like, I mean, I've had some pretty dire losses down here and came down twice last year and lost them. Just pipped at the post, like, so to come down and I see Excel, accelerate through that second half is unbelievable. Thought like the boys put in a serious shift. Very, very proud of them. Talk us through that game clinching try at the end. Oh, well, you know, talking about going after them and Billy Burns made an unbelievable read and I just followed it up with uh, what a teammate should be doing on the wing there. So uh, hats off to him. That's what we've been working on all week and it's paid off, obviously, just at the end of the game there. It's great. How much do you say about what Ulster can do now, pushing on for the rest of the season? Yeah, I think that's a big marker of what, you know, the, the respect we want to earn from all the teams in the ERC so yeah I think that was a massive game in, in doing that so you know we can't just live off that game we've got into pros we've got your Hattingen Cup to get through here so it's a big push on through this next block of nine games you mentioned the defence there how big was Jared Payne in driving that attitude all week oh, <laughs> he wasn't even here we had uh, Dan Soper and uh, Jared Payne off with Covid so it was very player led this week but we had them through WhatsApp and giving them feedback from training through the week so hats off to the lads some you know, not getting coach-led and taking that on themselves. And we really drove it this week. And hats off to Al for really setting the tone of the start of the game, like, and really pushing us on. And finally, just from yourself, being in Ireland camp over the last month, that must be a big ambition for you now to push on there. Absolutely huge. Like, you know, it is what it is. It's very frustrating not to get any game time or any involvement, but, look, that's the way it goes. I thought, like, the centres that were in camp played very well. So it was now, it's now my turn to, over these next block of nine games, to put my foot forward for the Six Nations. And, that's what I'm inevitably trying to do. Congrats tonight. Awesome. Thanks, Mill, for coming to us. Thank you very much.